Hello, today I'm going to read You Will Be My Friend by Peter Brown. Lucy was very excited when she woke up. Mom, I've decided I'm going to make a new friend today. Isn't that exciting? That is exciting, Lucille. But how do you plan on finding a new friend? Mom, the forest is crawling with fun critters. Surely one of them will want to be my friend. This is going to be great. So Lucy went outside to begin her search. Good luck, Lucille. Bye, Mom. I cannot wait to make a new friend. We're going to do cartwheels and climb trees and have picnics and go swimming and have a dance party. Lucy's search got off to a great start when a nice critter invited her to play. Ooh, ooh, yes, I'd love to join you, Ribbit. But things didn't work out. Oh well, there are plenty of other critters in the forest. It didn't take long for Lucy to find another friendly looking animal. I'll just go up and introduce myself. Munch, munch. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to climb into your breakfast. That friendship didn't work out either. Lucy did her best to win over the forest animals. She was helpful. Don't you worry, we'll get that nasty smell out. She asked lots of questions. So tell me, what's it like to fly? and she tried to fit in with everyone she met. But Lucy was starting to feel ridiculous. She came close to making friends a few times. Thanks for inviting me to lunch. Buzz, buzz, buzz. But something always went wrong. Sorry I ate your house. Lucy couldn't believe how hard it was to make a new friend. She was ready to be friends with anyone. Well, almost anyone. Squeak, 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 squeak. Come back here and have fun with me. That's when things got ugly. You won't get any snacks unless you start liking me right now. You will be my friend. I can wait. Lucy tried to calm herself down. Take a deep breath, Lucy. You can do this. You can make a new friend. Just be yourself. Doesn't anybody want to be my friend? This is hopeless. It looked as if Lucy would never find a new friend. Squawk. And then a funny thing happened.
squawk, squawky squawk. <gasps> oh my gosh, are you asking me to be your friend? Squawk, I accept. And that's the story of how these two friends found each other. The end. And a note from the author, Peter Graham, says, Over the years, I've learned three important lessons about making new friends. Lesson one, always be yourself. Lesson two, New friends appear when you least expect it. Lesson three, do not scream, you will be my friend, at people. Trust me, that never works. I hope you enjoyed today's reading of You Will Be My Friend by Peter Brown. Remember to like and subscribe. Thanks!